Hello all, uh, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, we'll discuss how to install Git on Windows and how to clone a repository. So as you're all aware, Git is a free and open source distributed version control system uh, designed to handle everything from uh, small to a very large scale projects with the uh, speed and efficiency. Of course, uh, tracking the changes in very uh, in any uh, set of files uh, usually used for uh, coordinating the program programmers uh, collaboratively. So using this uh, Git, the programmers in different parts of the world uh, can come under one roof and uh, work uh, collaboratively. Yeah. So let's go ahead and uh, download Git. So go to Git downloads and uh, click on the first link yeah click on windows here and just download this uh, you know standalone installer 64 bit i have already uh, downloaded it so it's here yeah just double click on this click on, and keep all the options as default next next yeah click keep everything default Yes, it's getting installed. Uh, yeah, we'll wait for it to finish. Yes, so it's installed now. So no need to launch. Uh, going to be release notes as well just click on finish and uh, so just to confirm go to command prompt click on cmd enter just give git uh, hyphen hyphen version so you should get the git version here so you can see see it's installed here uh, git version with this in uh, windows yes so let's uh, this is how you install git so let's clone the repository now so we have a simple repository so just uh, we'll try to clone that git github log into your repository so this is the repository uh, cpp so just uh, go to your repository and uh, yes in the code you have this link that is https link just copy this because using this link you will be communicating so uh, copy this link go to the folder where you want to clone this repository so as i told you we uh, yeah we had discussed in our previous video we have only one simple uh, readme file here so okay downloads okay d drive okay we'll just do a clone here so git bash here and to clone you have git clone and paste the url here yeah https link enter so it's very simple it's a uh, clone now you can have a look you have your cpp folder and your readme file so this is uh, uh, how you clone your uh, uh, repository using https uh, uh, link and if you want to uh, clone via ssh you have the link here you can just copy it but uh, yes let's delete this uh, now for time being so delete this so just git bash here okay so git clone and uh, let's just paste this but you have not set your ssh keys so it will throw an error of course uh, yes as you can see here the key uh, permission denied public key uh, you are getting this error yes to solve this uh yes we'll just generate the ssh key and add it to our computer so to generate the ssh key just go to uh yeah uh get here from the start and uh, yes you need to give a command to generate the key so that is ssh key gen ssh key gen yes hyphen t uh, r s a so this is like the encryption that you are uh, using so hyphen t uh, for type type of encryption that you are using rsa encryption is being used here so the base minus b uh, 
4096 b uh, hyphen b is uh, the base yes 4096 and uh, of course hyphen c to uh, you know you can give your email id here so yes and uh, yeah yeah that's all on the command so hit enter so enter the file in which you want to save okay just uh, uh, hit enter again and enter a passphrase yes you can give the passphrase here so yes enter and enter the passphrase again yes okay so hit enter and your ssh key is generated so now uh, uh, we want to uh, you know let our computer know that uh, we want to use this ssh key so you can just evaluate eval and a dollar symbol and ssh agent and uh, hyphen s yes so enter yes it's been uh, it, 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 it it's been identified so we can uh, now go ahead and add this uh, ssh key so ssh um, add yes okay the folder path okay the path is yes this is the path ssh uh, uh yeah uh, id rsa uh, rsa yeah this is the path you can also even confirm that uh, you can go to your c users yes this one and ssh yes this is the one correct so add dot ssh so and id underscore rsa okay this is the path so location that uh, that's our home folder so click enter and yeah it's asking for the passphrase give the passphrase that you just uh, gave before so enter yes it's ident uh, identity is added now so now we need to copy this and add it in, add it uh, in the you know uh, keys ssh and uh, ssh key section of our uh, github repository so you can go to this uh, path and uh, you can just right click and you can just edit in notepad plus plus and copy this or else yes as uh, uh, you can also uh, take it from the uh, yeah this command uh, uh, the git command itself the clip and uh, yeah uh, from this path dot uh, ssh slash uh, id underscore rsa uh, dot pub this is the file so we just copy to clipboard so i think yes it is copied now so we'll go to the repository we'll go to sorry uh, in the right top corner uh, uh, settings and yes ssh and uh, gpg key so here uh, you click on new ssh key you can give a title say for example data key yes and you can just paste it here and uh, add ssh key yes it's added now you're good to go now you go back and try to clone it clone your uh, repo again so yes get clone i think this is the one right i think yes yeah hit enter and it's clone so you can just go back and see you would have in, in the d drive you would find the repository and the readme file of course yeah so this is one of the way uh, uh and again uh, the encryption method that we used was RSA. You can use other encryptions as well. So uh, let me just show you that as well. So I'll just delete this key. Delete. Yeah, delete this. And uh, of course, we'll delete the repository again. Uh, we'll try this method with the uh, other encryption. Delete, delete this. And uh, yes. So also we'll uh, go to the, yeah here and we'll try out another encryption that is ssh uh, keygen uh, yeah type other type that is the ed uh, 25519 so this is other type of encryption and 
yeah, iPhone C and you can provide your mail ID okay so and we can uh, hit enter and it will ask you for the file okay you can just uh, hit enter again asking for the passphrase okay give a passphrase confirm it again okay so now the new um, ssh is created so we will uh, uh, yeah now we want to again uh, let our computer know that we want to use this so we'll just evaluate once eval dollar symbol yes ssh agent agent and hyphen s yeah enter yes we got the ping so we want to add this now we want to add the this ssh key so just ssh add yes uh, the dot ssh and uh, the yeah the name the name is here this is the this would be the name of that file uh, yeah uh, which uh, what i'm talking is like the explorer okay i'll show you that go to yeah this pc c users uh yeah ssh and yeah these are the two files that uh, got generated now this was uh, previously through rsa encryption through ed2551a uh, it is generated uh, just now and uh, we'll use this file now so yeah just a moment so yeah that's why here uh, we'll have id underscore uh, ed2519 i uh, hope this is correct yes this is correct uh, we'll hit on enter it's asking for the passphrase give the passphrase hit on enter and it's identified and added and uh, yeah we'll have to just copy the uh, copy the ssh key and we need to add it uh, into our github repository so we'll just clip take it to clipboard and we'll just uh, copy it yeah so yeah dot ssh slash id underscore ed2519 dot the pub okay uh yes i think this is all enter and uh, it's copied now we'll go to our repository settings and uh, ssh so new ssh yes uh data key we'll just copy this yeah so now add ssh key yeah it's added now so we'll try to clone it again the same way and hit enter and it's asking for the uh, yes i think uh, it has taken and we successfully cloned this yes uh, oh sorry i used the https link again sorry uh, i need to use the yeah ssh link so we'll go to git and uh, yeah uh, rep our repository and we'll take the ssh link sorry uh, yes yes it's here we'll copy the ssh link and uh, yeah i think yes it's here so git clone and uh, the link paste the link and yeah i'll just delete the repo once so that it's clear yeah so hit on enter and it's asking for the passphrase and hit enter so yeah it's cloned using the ssh uh, link uh yeah so that's all uh, on how to install git and uh, how to clone a repository uh, and uh, with the, uh, adding ssh keys thanks for watching the video uh, if you like this video please give it a thumbs up thank you